I want to bring you this situation, this developing story in Scotland where one person's dead, three people have been injured. Uh, this was a number of shootings on the Isle of Skye and Westeros. Uh, the incidents are being treated as linked. 39-year-old man has been arrested in connection with them. Well, GB News' Annie Butterworth joins us from the area to give us the latest on all of this. What more can you tell us, Annie? Good morning, Eamon and Isabel. Yes, as you've just been describing, a man has died and uh, several others have been injured in what police have described as a series of shootings across the West Highlands. Now, from what we understand, the initial incident took place on the Isle of Skye, which is to the northwest of me here in a village called Tarksavik. There, police say a 32-year-old woman was found seriously injured. Now, she's been taken to the Queen Elizabeth Hospital in Glasgow and there's been no update on her condition overnight. Now, from that initial incident, we understand that a second event took place in a village eight miles away. There, police say a 47-year-old man was pronounced dead at the scene. Again, police have said a firearm was used in the second incident. Um, they haven't said about the first incident yet. And then from that incident, we understand that there was a third event that took place in the village of Dorney, which is just off to my, the back end of me here. There, there was two people that were injured in, again, firearm. But police have described it as a firearm incident. One man, who we don't know his age or any details, was taken to Rigmore Hospital in Inverness. And the woman, we understand, um, believed to be uh, related or um, uh, from the same property, was taken to the, the hospital on the, village, on the Isle of Skye. Uh, again, police have given no updates on their conditions overnight. A 39-year-old man, police confirmed, has been arrested in connection with all three incidents which police have said are linked and there is no wider threat to the community. However, they have said that there will be an increased police presence over the coming days to reassure local residents. Right, OK. Situation. Yeah. Thanks, Annie. Thank you very much indeed. Annie Butterworth there uh, for us on the Isle of Skye. Thank you very much indeed.